Let's see one problem from linear differential equation with constant coefficient. We need to solve this. Uh, ex extremely easy it can be because uh, first we will find the complementary function and then we will move ahead with the particular integral. I hope you must have seen my uh, lecture on uh, this particular concept as to how we move ahead with this. We have discussed the rule for cos ax and for e power ax so first finding complementary function so convert this from d form to m form so for complementary function first find the auxiliary equation auxiliary equation will be m square plus 9 and equate it to 0 so m square is minus 9 so m will come out to be plus minus 3 iota so we can uh, write this as m1 equals to 0 plus 3 iota and m2 as so in case the roots are uh, conjugate complex numbers we write the complementary function as e power ax this is of the form a plus iota b and a minus iota b so we write the complementary function as e power ax a here is 0 so e power 0x inside c1 cos of bx b here is 3 so cos of 3x plus c2 sin of 3x so we can simplify it more and write our complementary function finally as e power 0x is 1. So we can write as c1 cos 3x plus c2 sin 3x. So this is our uh, complementary function. Now moving ahead with the particular integral that will be 1 upon f of d which is d square plus 9 operating on 2 cos 3x plus e power minus 3x. Now we can separate this out and write this as 2 1 upon d square plus 9 operating on cos 3x plus 1 upon d square plus 9 operating on e power minus 3x. Now replace d square by minus of a square so when you replace this by a minus of 9 you will get a 0 so what we do in that case is differentiate this denominator so you will get 2d and add multiply by an extra x so multiply by x and differentiate the denominator and write this cos 3x plus if you put here also uh, in place of uh, d put a from e power ax so you will get uh, 1 upon no problem in this case because uh, here minus 3 if you put in place of d so you will get 9 plus 9 that is 18 uh, e power minus 3x okay now uh, 2 and 2 can get cancelled in this step. So you are left with x. And now 1 by d is same as integration. So I can write integral of cos 3x dx. You would have also multiply and divide by d. So, uh, so as to get d square in denominator and again replace d square by minus of a square. But that is a two step process. Just when you see 1 by d just integrate. Plus this is perfectly fine 1 by 18 e raised to power minus 3x so you are getting integration of cos is simply sine so x is sine 3x and will divide by the derivative of 3x which is 3 plus 1 upon 18 e raised to power minus 3x now this was our particular integral solved now y is cf plus pi cf was your uh, c1 cos 3x plus c2 sin 3x and pi
सो फाइन इजी वन जस्ट फाइन द कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री फंक्शन विच वॉज अगेन इजी इफ यू नो द कॉन्सेप्ट हाउ टू राइट फॉर द कॉन्जुगेट कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर्स एंड देन द पर्टिकुलर इंटीग्रल सेपरेटेड एंड अप्लाइड टू डिफरेंट रूल्स टू गेट टू माई फाइनल आंसर 